the first one that I really need is my extension cord, of course. Um, when you go back to your hometown, everybody and anybody is using the plugs, the wall plugs, in order to use it for their, uh, what do you call it, uh, irons, uh, to use it to um, uh, for their charges. My husband and I, we would usually bring our own extension cord. Um, we have a room of our own in um, both my in-laws as well as uh, my parents' house. So we have a room of our own, but we still need to bring uh, an extension cord. It's much easier. Um, I would usually bring the four plugs or the five plug ones. I'll use it for my um, charging my telephone, my um, iPad, uh, my camera, all that sort of things, all the good stuff. I need to bring an extension cord. Uh, sometimes even my in-laws use them too. So it's really essential that I bring an extension cord just in case. Keep it in your bag, um, in your traveling bag, just in case you need it and you don't need to worry or forget about it. Next thing, a non-makeup related item that I would bring is books or our books. Um, I would usually bring two books with me. Um, the one that I'm reading right now is The Circle. So far, it's okay. Uh, but I'm not that far in. I'm only at page 30 if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. So, um, I need to bring two books just in case um, I don't know. I Just in case I finish this book and I don't have anything else to read. So I need to bring two books with me. Next one is my iPad. This depends actually. My iPad does not have a 3G connection to it. Um, it depends on Wi-Fi. So actually there's no point in bringing it. But I do have some videos or movies in this iPad that I want to watch um, if I'm feeling bored or I don't like what's on TV, so I'll just depend on this one. Sometimes I'll bring it, and if I do bring it, I'll bring along my headphones so that I don't disturb others whilst they are watching uh, their movies or even reading, whatever. So, iPad, in case I do bring it, this will be my essential too. Cameras. Cameras, Nintendo DS, cameras, Nikon. Um, Where's my Nintendo DS? Oh, here we go. Nintendo DS, in case. <laughs> in case you get bored. I mean, I do have um, some games on my iPad, um, but you know the glare and everything, so I don't really like it. But I'll just bring my Nintendo DS just in case. Next one would be medicines. One of them is this one. This is the Yoko Yoko, um, which is for stiff shoulder and muscular aches. I do get them from time to time, um, usually here, from lugging around such a heavy handbag. <laughs> um, or even um, if I get so tired of uh, walking around from places to places, this is really great for that. Um, I do bring my flu medicine or my sinus medicine and um, what else do I bring? I bring some vitamins um, and that's about it, yeah. Raya cookies and tidbits in case that you are in charge of buying Raya cookies this year. Usually I'll just buy one or two. The reason why I don't want to buy too much is sometimes you know your relatives will visit from one house to another so they don't intend to stuff themselves with a lot of raya cookies or tidbits usually what they'll eat is um, lontong or um, some mi whatever that they are serving hot in that house so when they come to over to your house they tend to not overstuff themselves with raya cookies and instead opt for something hot so that's the reason why I don't um, buy too much Raya cookies. So I'll buy just one or two 
and the one that I'm buying this year is Crepe Pisang and also Rainbow Cookies um, and that's it I'm not going to buy anything else um, I'll probably buy maybe one or two more for my house but lotions lotions is essential um, I usually opt for the Righteous Butter from Soap and Glory but the thing is lately I've not been seeing it in Sephora I'm not quite sure why uh, most probably they have discontinued it or they are changing the packaging I believe they are changing the packaging but if they do come up with the uh, righteous butter I'm just going to buy the big jar again because I've already finished mine um, I'll usually scoop some out and put it into a smaller jar instead um, so that it's easier to travel with um, so I'm going to buy a big one I really like that because um, the smell, the scent of the righteous butter is amazing. Um, it lasts for a long time um, and it's that fresh kind of scent, really fresh floral scent. I really like that. Raya clothes and Raya money. Of course. <laughs> if you have um, nephews, cousins, uh, siblings, small ones, you intend to bring Raya money, of course, right? So these are the Raya packets that I've received this year. This is from diana.com.my. Um, I bought my Raya clothes from there. And this is from Sincerely by Us Shawls. So Raya packets is essential too. Um, sometimes my father would ask for them. Cooling spray. Like I've said previously, this has multiple uses uh, for setting your makeup as well as cooling you down. This is essential if you want to um, just mist yourself with something cooling. It's humid! <laughs> so you need to have this in your handbag. On the humid bandwagon is also a hand fan. I got this one, I think, for two ringgit at Mr. DIY. I like the color, it's blue. Um, this is really nice. Um, I put this one in my handbag. And there's also another one in my backpack. Sunglasses. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's hot, people. It's really hot in Malaysia. The ones that I'm bringing with me this year, um, Mr. Happy Feet bought this for my birthday. This is Emporio Armani's glasses. I don't know the model, but that's how it looks like. This one is the tortoise shell kind of colors, and this one is in purpley kind of colors. Uh, Paris Hilton, let me just show you how it looks like on me. You like it? It has that cheetah kind of print or... Giraffe. It looks like that. It's big on my face but I still do like it. If you are confident in carrying off the sunglasses, whatever style it is, as long as you are confident, it will look nice on you. It doesn't matter what it looks like. And don't let anyone judge you for what you are wearing. You want to wear whatever you want to wear? Breath mints or candies. <laughs> this is the Mentos yogurt flavored ones. Um, the mint ones from Mentos too, it's really good. Uh, you need to have a good breath on yourself in case you're seeing your future mother in law or even. Or even your relatives. <laughs> In case they suddenly, you, know, you don't want to have stinky breath when you talk to them. Regardless of how many houses that you've visited and how many rendangs or pulot or lemang that you've eaten. That, that's not. That's not. Allow you to make an excuse not to have a good breath. So you don't want to bring toothpaste and toothbrush, right? So I might as well just chew on something or even chew on chewing gum just to keep your breath uh, smelling good. Okay, so we're down to the last two. My handbag. 
which I don't have it with me right now. I'll bring the most comfortable one with me. Um, like I said, if you're walking around in high heel shoes, oh, that reminds me, high heel shoes too. <laughs> in your, if you're walking around in high heel shoes, you need to have a good handbag, and it needs to be comfortable. You cannot bring too much in your handbag in that case too. So last thing is uh, perfumes. Actually, I think this is beauty related um, items as well. So perfumes, um, for example, the one from Fresh. Um, this is the vial one. I'll place this one in my handbag. Uh, easy. Um, it doesn't leak, so much easier to travel with. I. I'm not going to buy the Traveler ones. I think that it's not easy to replace it. Um, someone did mention it on YouTube that day. Um, how do you clean up the Traveler? I don't know either. So I'll bring a vial of my perfume, my favorite perfumes. And um, the ones that I'm loving at the moment is from Philosophy in Pure Grace. Amazing Grace is nice too, but I think I prefer Pure Grace more. And that's it! That's all for my Raya Essentials. I hope that you've enjoyed watching this video. Um, I'm not doing a tutorial this year because editing takes too much time. So no makeup tutorials. But I hope this video has been helpful in order for you to determine what are the essential things that you need to bring um, during Raya? Can you, you can watch this video in case you forget anything on your list um, that you need to bring. And I hope that it has been helpful. Please watch my other girls that I'll put their links down below um, for their videos. Take care and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye! I forgot. Before I go, Selamat Hari Raya or Happy Eid of Bye!